Okay, this next one is for the infant, who again is uh, birth to one years of old. Uh, first we want to do is, uh, if, is we want, after the scene is safe, we can come up to the baby and we want to check consciousness. Hey, hey, are you okay? If there's no response, um, then we ask someone to call 911 or EMS. Uh, then we want to um, do a head tilt, chin lift. Again, for the baby, it's a little bit less than the child and the adult. Look, listen, feel for about um, no more than five seconds. If there's no sign of breathing, uh, with your face mask, you would reverse it so the nose points down towards the, the mouth, and this will cover both the nose and mouth. Uh, again, with the head tilted back, you're going to give two, two brass little puffs into the lungs. Once the two breaths go in, I'm going to check the brachial pulse on your side, which is in the, in the arm, just above the elbow. Again, with your two fingers, not your thumb, for no more than 10 seconds. If the baby has a pulse but is not breathing, I would give uh, one rescue breath every five seconds, counting one 1,000, inhale, breathe, one 1,000, inhale, breathe, three 1,000. Okay, with the head tilted back slightly and the face mask covering the, the whole face and mouth, one 1,000, inhale, one one thousand inhale. One one thousand inhale. One one thousand inhale. I would continue that for t up to two minutes. At two minutes after I give the breath with the head tilted back the whole time, I would recheck the pulse with the brachial artery using two fingers. No more than 10 seconds. If the victim, if the baby does not have a pulse, then I would do CPR. If the baby still is not breathing, I would continue rescue breaths at one every three seconds. Uh, in any case, I would continue this until someone takes over equally or higher trained, or if I get exhausted or if the scene becomes unsafe. 